why I think it could be seen as a threat is because uh, with their large scale platforms and with the massive amount of data they are able to capture in this digital era that relies majorly on data to uh, propagate income, to propagate capital, to propagate influence. Uh, they have the most critical asset within the digital era and that's why they can become very powerful as we go forward in the age of artificial intelligence, big data, and all the innovative technologies that I imagined. So they could become really powerful because uh, they have the first mover advantage already and based on the network effects that they're able to create in these uh, new systems and business models that they rely upon, it will be difficult for new entrants to easily catch up with them so they can become really powerful, especially in the marketplace. And if you are strong in the marketplace, you have the capacity to control uh, policy decisions, you have the capacity to influence socioeconomic outcomes, and you are globally a giant. So uh, there is a need, there is that incentive to say, okay, let's keep an eye on these. What can we do to keep them in check? Because if we leave them to self-regulate themselves, of course, they're going to be biased towards themselves and towards their own priorities beyond the interest of the whole world. And so that's what I think about it.